Hey friends, it's Sonia. Welcome back to my daily vlog. I don't know about you, but a little pop in the Goodwill on the way home to pick some shelves just makes me feel good. Today, I remember to pack my paper and my recyclable bag. It's all good. So the first thing that caught my attention, a big hello, is this beautiful set. And then I found the tag, so they're not selling them individually. There's, it's an entire set for $8.99. These pillar candles were, oh my gosh, amazing. It's just a lot of glass. And so it's really overwhelming to see such a big set right off the bat. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna pick a little bit, see what's here, and I may circle back around. This was cute. You got this. Maybe it was a message to me. You got this. You should have took them. Scary person. Beady eyed things. And look, another giant set, right? Now these were actually priced individually. So, but again, if you do a little ding with your finger, um, it's just not thick glass. So they're $4.99 a piece. At least the smaller ones are. There's an entire collection there. Um, but I decided to leave them because like I said, the glass is just, you know, it's more decorative glass and honestly, I'd probably buy them. I bought stuff like that and it just doesn't even make it home. This bird though, this bird is solid. All right, we're taking the bird. That was cute. And you know, today I brought my paper. I'm learning as well, um, that some Goodwills don't have paper and today at this one, what is it with this? There's like all these you know, mosaic stained glass pieces. This one was $10. It was gorgeous. I wanted it in my heart, deep in my heart. I wanted it, but at $10, I'm here to flip. I'm here to at least, at least at minimum, double my money. And so I'm like 20 bucks is putting me into a whole other place that I just don't feel comfortable with. So I left it there. That was a cute little vase. Um, I liked how it looked kind of like it had polka dots. This here, I'm like, whoa, okay. This is interesting, all that iridescent made me look at it. I'm like, I wonder how much they want on this. Not that I was going to pick it up, but I was just, you know, curiosity killed the cat here. Um, but I couldn't find the price and it was so heavy, I did not want to turn it over. So, this right here. Oh, this was hard to leave behind, $4.99. I'm like, yes, you're a planter. Love this, you know, this vintage girl here. She's got florals, her big ball gown. And I'm like, this is beautiful, $4.99. I'm gonna flip her. And then I look at her hand and she's missing a finger. So if I was buying this for myself, I wouldn't care about that. I love the idea of having a collection of planters that are all different shapes and sizes and really whimsical. Um, but again, I'm staying focused on flipping and listen, I'm good. I can fix stuff. By the way, that's still here waiting for that, for the orange to go off so I can get that for at least half off. Um, but I'm good. I can fix stuff. I can paint stuff, but I cannot do surgery on a finger. So I left her there kind of sad. I'm still sad about it. Um, Okay, what's down here? Found this leaf, $2.99. This one is actually, uh, was it wooden? It's not ceramic. Oh, that one didn't make it. So I decided to take this one for $2.99 in my wheelhouse. I liked that. But I started to say before how, honestly, I got up to the register at the very end and they had no newspaper. I'm glad I had my own bag, but they had not one bit of newspaper to wrap anything in. So. I, I'm just learning to like stuff paper in my bag as I go into Goodwill. So now I've picked up two leaves, that's awesome. This one, I like this, this amber colored glass, $3.99. That's a pretty nice piece. That's an easy flip and still keeps it at a reasonable price, a price point that I like. Nope, your feet are going to fall through the cart. Don't do it, Sonya. Good. That's right, let's play a little game here where we move things around. See, I needed the leaf just to be able to be the car seat. I love this. It's just got a little bling bling on it, the moon, the sun. I think its nose is supposed to be like that, but honestly, when I get back, if I really wanna add a touch of gold, I can, but I think it's supposed to be indented. It's just the way it is. It's the way it is. I love you the way you are. So, I'm very happy with that. Look how nice our cart looks, see? You ever step back and go, my gosh, my cart is beautiful. Now this guy, I don't think his, his face is supposed to be like that, okay? But he's only $2.99. I can add gold onto him, make him look like the other one. 
So I think that will be a hot seller. I'm gonna grab it. I loved this. First time I ever came across these, this is painted. I don't know if somebody did these or they were purchased like this. I'm guessing purchased like this, um, but they are ceramic faux books. Look at it, there's a black one and like this peachy orange colored one. $2.99 a piece. I'm a book lover. It has that vintage charm to it. Oh, that elephant is still there with a the crown onto it. You know what? Somebody messaged me and they said, um, wrote on one of my videos and they said, you could probably turn that into a night light. And now I'm like, you know what? I bet you I could buy like little bulbs, night light bulbs. And then if I find these really cool things on the shelves that um, have holes in them. I mean, yeah, put a light inside. Wouldn't that most make the most fantastic night light? You're brilliant. You're brilliant. I might have to go just kind of down that rabbit hole and see um, see what's out there. You guys also told me that you think that you can find the rubber stoppers for the piggy banks. All the piggy banks that are missing their little plug. So that's something else I'm going to look for as well. $4.99. I really like this. But then I saw, I'm like, what are you? I have no idea what that is. I have no idea what that is. What are we looking at here? Does anybody know? Was there so supposed to be something on that? I don't know what that was. So it kind of freaked me out. I'm like, a little pointy bit. I don't know what that is. We're just going to leave that. I saw this. I love this. $4.99. Had a little schmutz inside of it. She's beautiful, isn't she? This was really nice as well. I'm like, I'm going to grab that. And then I realized, wait. Wait, am I holding this wrong? Does it have a bottom? It doesn't. What are you supposed to do with that? It has no top or bottom. At first I thought it was a candle holder, but I genuinely don't think it is. So I left it there for that reason. All right, we're picking, we're picking. We're picking anything. Anything on the bottom shelf. Oh my gosh. So um, one of my staff actually put one of these outside our shop. It's so cute. So we have the frog one. And I see that they also make a little, I guess that's a fox. They're adorable. So um, yeah, they the sunlight hits them and they uh, charge up and their eyes glow. Super cute. This guy here was really cute. Oh, I look over and I'm like, oh, that Capa de Monte, a flower is still here. I did, That's the one I debated getting and it was chipped up even though it had the papers with it, you know, you guys overwhelmingly told me in the comments, no, nah, just leave it, you know, it's chipped, just leave it. So I did, I did. I also left that vase, that Mexican uh, vase that you just saw. And, you know, it was really nice. It was $4.99. I wasn't, I loved it, but I'm like, eh, let's see what else I can find here. This piece was an interesting piece as well. I debate it, I guess it's a gourd. Oh my gourd, I think it's a gourd. So I thought that was a, just an interesting, you know, piece of art. This, my last one I bought with all the feathers, um, that one sold, found a home in New York. But this one here, I mean, I like the colors, but I didn't like the face necessarily. So I left that one. That's an interesting ceramic there that looks old. Okay, this section is the, the metal section. It, oh guys. It's that vase. It's the haunted weird vibe vase. How many weeks now has this, this piece been floating around? I'm telling you, don't take it. Don't take it. There's something not right with that vase. I like it, but I, I don't know. It has some weird feels about it. And now it, here it is in a whole different section. See, I'm telling you. And, but it keeps getting moved around the store here. And so I think it's because... Other people as well, they're like, okay, look at this vase. And then it just gets dropped somewhere else. Like there's something, there's something about that vase. There was definitely something about these candlesticks, the blue, the white, they're all brass. They were $7.99, so that was a splurge, but I felt like the quality was there. This little piece right here, love that like diamond pattern. That was gorgeous. No sticker. Um, I brought it up to the front and I thought if, if they sell it for just a couple bucks, I'll take it. And I ended up getting, getting it for $2.99, so I was very happy with that. Those sell all the time. Cute for a little votive candle. That's an amazing piece right there. What was that? $6.99, $5.99, $6.99? That would be so nice decorated for the season and you could change it out. Those candelabras are beautiful. 
So yeah, that vase, seeing that again, I'm like, what? Um, yeah, but it's there's def definitely something weird. So I'm curious to see how long that vase just floats around, floats around that store. Ironically, I use the word floats around. I don't know what it does at night. It probably just floats around. Last night I watched um, Haunted Mansion. Speaking of um, haunting vibes, it was so good. Have you guys seen that? I watched it on Disney Plus. It's free and it was so fun. I just thought it was a really cute, um, definitely a cute movie to watch, especially this spooky season. So if you have access to watch it, you definitely should. I think you'd like it. Cute little tray there. I don't know if that's called Monkey Paw, this particular kind or not, but you know me and my divided dishes. I thought that was really cute. And this. $4.99. If you could see the size of this, like this was in the Halloween section. I don't know if somebody's just dropped that off there or what, but oh my gosh, look at the size of it. $4.99. I got my money's worth there. So this was a very successful trip. Like I said, I'm glad I have my paper um, because I sure needed it.